for the young Kenyans. I want them to go on the streets at times and just have some fun. Life can't be everything. All day work, no play makes Jack a dull boy. Let me go to the point that I want to touch. After this is all said and done, Yevurai will be the spot that ignited fire in the entire world for the light, for the creed that all life are created equal in the entire world. We Kenyans, with the cloud of all the world, it's time for truth. Kenya and God cut, cut Williams in 2024. We ain't going back. If you're following, come with us. But it's the time to use common sense, stop paying debt before food. Nigga! And now about death. Because we have turned this into a game of death. Buonaruto. Christianity, where are you? You have shown us that death can be done so easy on our brothers, young brothers. Our mom's asking, Kalisho, where are you when the kids are dying? I just cried like a little bitch. Kenya, we're going to change some things. It's not even time for leadership. Something like death, then it need to be a subject in our secondary schools. If death is going to be done so easy like this, we know we had the gunshots that happened in Gizurai. There were more than 300. And now you say you banned the quality? You know, most in the house, most in these spaces. And some of them are coming with an agenda. I've been listening to some moles. Some of them coming with the agenda of LGBT. Africans done refused with their behind. And the entire world is coming for your behind. You better know that. I lived in Hollywood for four years. 50% of the gay people who live there are gays. I don't know why they want this chocolate from the Africans so bad. The advertisement, everything. My people, watch out for your behind. You come in with the LGBT, you know, agenda, we can sniff it from a distance. Because it's like someone coming double-sided. If you come in with an agenda to kuangamisha my family, my ability to have kids with some other agendas, bro, I can't even give you a platform to tell me shit. If you come in with an agenda for LGBT, this is not the place. For that bullshit. <laughs> the triangle. Life is a triangle. The way they play this game. And this triangle is enhanced by titles. Kenyans, we're shitting these titles. We're making these MP titles so horrible to work. A work where someone can go without food. Because they went broke. Just like other professions. And to add, with the biggest of them all, we need a stipend. Each and every of these Gen Z need a stipend of 5,000 shillings every goddamn month. If we are fighting, we better, they better give us this 5,000 by next Monday. $5,000. The money we are getting. Don't be paying goddamn debt before food. We need food. Everybody hungry. The first thing when we did, we went to the parliament, we ate. These niggas been holding meetings. They can't in fact provide you seats and food for them to tell you their goddamn story. We're also gonna stop this, you know, goddamn bullshit of we all going when we see someone with his, a, a goddamn entourage of cars. We go by the roadside. They need to come somewhere, it's a, a, alleged food. Give us some goddamn, every meeting starts with food. $5,000 stipend. We need to be fighting for stipend, like the developed countries. Niggas get some money every month. What the fuck? People gotta get some money. The first thing they need to change, even before we got them. Ruto must go, my people. I love you. Another day, another dollar. Kenya revolution. Gen Z, Kenya revolution. And Tuesday, we bring it up. But my people, be together. Because these niggas are now killing us. 
be together. They're taking advantage of us, man. These soldiers are indisciplined. You see, Kahawa, it's like the devil's pot. Get right. I'm from Gezo. I used to drink with these cops. And these Gezoi cops are compromised now. Because they're the ones who probably did this job. More than 300 people, my people, I'm telling you, after the story is said, Gezoi gonna be the spot that ignited fire, a fire that will never be stopped to bring the African child to equal standards. Life is created equal. This triangle, this triangle, one teacher talking to 40 students, one politician talking to a thousand people, one person, one motivational speaker talking to goddamn too many niggas, telling them bullshit. This triangle gotta call these titles. Let's change these titles, my people. I love you. Chojo Shukali, Ruto must go. Hey, 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 my people, my people, Ruto must go. Hey, 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 moto, 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 moto. This government is burning a crime scene, the place where the bodies were dumped. Instead of removing them, excavating and investigating it and get to the bottom of it, they have decided to us on the crime scene. I'm telling you guys, do we have a country? Tuko naishi. Dr. Mjulus. Hey, Eugene, ya kobana. Julius, she got my Hey, doctor. When I when I read it, it had not yet sounded in my head. Anyway, <laughs> hey, my friends, good morning. <laughs> morning, good morning. Uh, uh, there is a beautiful conversation we are having. Uh, uh, first of all, let me say, Ruto must go. I support that fully. All right, and you know, uh, I I was listening very keenly to uh, some lady here, former speaker, and she said that, you know, in this process of of removing Ruto from power, you know, it is a process. It is not something that is happening uh, out of blues. It is a process. So in this process of Ruto must go. We must be ready to die. All right. Everybody in this movement must be ready to die. Led by myself or beginning with myself. Because the moment we go to the street demanding for these MPs and Ruto and blah, blah, blah to vacate those offices, we are actually uh, 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 Chokozaring bees to put up a beehive to attack a quenda beehive not at the end up on a protective gears, you see, to now when a manuki up evo when Gina Wakisha woman a nuki, when Gina Sema, see to me choker, see to me to me ogopa. So we must be ready to face these people because remember, we have a situation where politicians will always divide and rule. All right. They will always try as much as possible to divide us along ethnic lines, along class, and what have you. So as young people in this pro-Ruto, uh, 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 anti-Ruto uh, uh, movement, let us stand together and speak in, 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 in full accord and tell this government that you factors it is time for us to fuck you, okay? Because, you know, just firing uh, uh, a cabinet, uh, according to me, I, I don't think that was fulfilling. Uh, the firing of the entire cabinet, with the exception of Musalia and, and Rigiji, that was not uh, fulfilling to me because I believe that the back will always stop with the head. It is the head that must roll, okay? When a certain CS is plundering government money or embezzling government money, that is in full, uh, uh, you know, the president is fully aware. There is nothing that can go on in any ministry without the knowledge of the president 
So as Dr. Mujulus, I support this. I will always be at the forefront to ensure that my country is led in a manner that is satisfying to all and sundry. And then uh, I have seen the former prime minister, Raila Odinga, uh, uh, and his brother too, of course, I, I listened to his brother yesterday, uh, talking about a government of uh, national unity. These people, we must discard all of them, whether you are a Luo, a Giriyama, a Kikuyu, blah, blah, blah. All these, these people, we must discard them. I, I saw Raila yesterday at uh, Kware. The people were chanting, Ruto must go, Ruto must go. You know, and Raila, we have mastered this politics. Everybody knows his politics. That after the election, he is always up there to seek from Katenusu. Na yom Katenusu to Mekata, na ndiyo mana pale jana Kware aliambua, atutaki yom Katenusu. Because uja jamande na tuua. Okay, so as we march tomorrow, to, as we march tomorrow, the message must be very clear. We don't want Ruto to be in that office. Okay, and then after Ruto is removed from that office, he idea as doing a chagua kwe number two, sijui speaker, hamas sijui chief justice. That is bullshit. If we are, if we are putting everything to a stop, everything must come to a halt. Kila kitu. We sweep this. We sweep everything. Thanks so much. Thank you.